What is going on, you guys? Brandon here, aka Brawadis. Bro. What the hell was that? Anyways, um, Brandon here, aka Brawadis, and today I am letting the person in front of me decide what I eat for 24. Brawadis sucks! Bro, what is that sh? What is that? Hold up, bro. Someone messing with me? Hold up. Bro, people think they got jokes right now? On my life, bro. Someone's on some hating shit right now. I don't know what, like. Bro, what is? Sucks. What's going on, guys? Noor here. What are we doing today, Brandon? Today, I'm letting the person in front of me decide what I eat for 24 hours. Yo, Noor, I don't want to do this video by myself. Would you want to do it with me? Under one condition. What's your condition? I get my morning coffee first. Under one condition. What would the one condition be? We can't get the coffee that we want to drink. It's up to the car in front of us. Whatever they order, we have to drink. Well, that's the point of the video, right? So let's go, guys. All right, guys. So per Nor's request, we just pulled up to the coffee shop. Look at this. We are here at Better Buzz Coffee. And oh, look at that car right there who just went ahead of us in the drive-thru. We are going to be drinking whatever that car in front of us is drinking. All righty. Thank you so much for waiting. Today. This might seem odd, but can I please order the same exact thing that the car in front of me just ordered? Sorry, can you repeat that one more time? Yeah, just like an exact copy of the order that the car in front of me just did. Oh, well, then you guys want the same order as the person in front of you, yeah? Yeah, and you don't have to tell us what he got. We want to be surprised. Okay, sounds good. And then uh, he could also pay for us too. <laughs> I'm joking, I'm joking, I'm joking, okay, I'm joking. <laughs> I mean, if he wants to, why not? Hi. How are you guys doing? Good, how are you? Doing pretty good. Have you been to a Better Buzz before? Yeah, I come I have. here every day. Every day? Wait, Nora, what, what is your usual order? From I get here? the iced or chata latte. I love that one. By any chance, is that what the person in front of us ordered? No. <laughs> Did he order like a boring, like, espresso? No, it's actually kind of interesting. Okay, okay, it was, good. It's a lot of caffeine, though, just to let you know. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> I hope you need it. Okay, thank you. We don't know what exact drink the man in front of us ordered. She warned us it was gonna be a lot of caffeine. So uh, I feel like for the rest of today's video, we're gonna be jumping off the walls. I'll bro. have a personality. Nor will finally be fun and not boring for this video. <laughs> thank God. <laughs> Wait, what is this? So it's two shots of espresso. Oh my God, where was that yeah, guy so going? Wait. They're a double shot. So there's a double shot of espresso? Yeah, they ordered that on top of another drink. Oh my oh god. My I thought it was like a puppuccino. I was like, do I look like a dog? <laughs> okay, so I'm guessing the man in front of us had a very, very busy day ahead. Busy day, busy week. Busy life, dude. This <laughs> is gonna keep him up for days. Okay, so this is, she said the first part of the drink. Two straight shots of espresso, and the other part of the drink is coming out right now. Wait, Nora, this is burning hot. Is that normal? And then, <laughs> okay. Oh my so god. these are iced coffees. Iced coffee, And it has four shots in it. Four, Four shots? What do you mean? Is oh. that legal? Dude, this guy must have had a busy... I know, I was like... like well, thank you so much. <laughs> yeah. Thank you, and uh, I, we'll try to enjoy it. Bye, have a good day. Four shots and a double shot? Six shots? We're going to pull over and find a safe spot where we could try this insane, psychotic, maniac drink. Nor, are you nervous to try this? Yeah, what do you mean? Dude, this is six total shots of, of espresso. Of espresso. <laughs> Oh my god. Look inside. It's straight black coffee. Two shots. Nothing added. Just straight black coffee. Cheers. Let's go. Ew, ew. No sugar, no cream. Okay, hold up. Time out, time out, time out. Okay, I, I'm not gonna offend anybody out there because I'm sure people who drink coffee a lot, this probably tastes normal to them. But from someone who never drinks coffee, I'm not a coffee drinker at all, this tasted like sewer water. How do you know what sewer water tastes like? I don't know. I have some crazy drunken nights. If I had to rate this, this is a zero. Zero, zero. It's way too strong of a coffee flavor. So four of those in here. That's what that's gonna taste like. Oh my gosh. Okay, so over here we have a iced coffee and it may look like just your average good tasting iced coffee, but the car in front of us for some reason added extra espresso to this drink. Yeah, there is a lot of like different flavors in here. So hopefully it will mask the taste of this. Let's try it now. Strong but good. 
I don't know about good, but it's a hell of a lot better than what we had at first. This has to be like a three or four out of 10. I give this a seven for his creativity because he added mint. Yeah, he added mint. He also added four shots of espresso. All right, Nora, I'm blaming you. You came outside with your microphone. I'm only helping you with the video if I get my morning coffee. This is morning crack. What if the guy watches your video, bro? Who, the guy in front of us that ordered this? <laughs> Well, if he's watching this video, drop a like on this video for this coffee. And you know what? Not just him. Everybody drop a like on this video right now. Okay, Nora, you got your morning coffee. How about we go get some food? Let me guess the person in front of us is going to choose what we eat too. Well, yeah, that's the whole point of this video, right? Okay, guys, so for lunch, Nora, are you down for some Mexican food? I love Mexican food. And yo, we live in San Diego, and everybody knows San Diego has the best taco shops. San Diego has the best Mexican food, obviously other than the authentic home, Mexico. I'm talking about in the United States, nobody beats Mexican food from San Diego. Mm -hmm. So uh, we just pulled up to this taco shop, Cotijan Mexican food, and we're gonna see what's up. Now let's just hope the person in front of us ordered some heat. I'm not gonna lie, I love all types of Mexican food. I love Hispanic food, so I feel like no matter what the car in front of me orders, I'm gonna like it either way. Hi, whatever the last person that was here ordered, can I just get the same thing, please? Let me double check what they ordered. Oh, look at this, guys. They have menudo here. I hope the person before us got menudo. I wonder what this person ordered. Time to find out what we're gonna eat. I'm excited. So. Uh, Dylan, Kevin, Axel? Yeah, Castillo. Okay. Castillo? Yeah. Castillo? Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, you ready? Yeah. What's up, Dylan, Kevin, Axel, Castillo? Thank you so much for watching my videos. I appreciate the support. Hopefully one day me and my brother can meet you guys. Thank you. And you got the best dad for doing this video. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, bro. His kids were fans, so make a little video for them. Thank you. Have a good day. Dude, his kids probably watch you so much to the point where like he recognized you from the YouTube. Oh, thank, you, thank you so much, bro. Take care. Yeah, you too. Hey, it was funny. He goes, uh, my kids, he's, what he was trying to tell me was like, he doesn't really know who I am, but I always pop up on his TV. Oh. Like he sees his kids watching me on, on his TV and I'm like, yeah, let's make a video for them. Okay guys, so we got the food right here. Nora, let me feel how heavy it is. It, it doesn't feel too heavy, so uh, I honestly wonder what it is. I kind of feel a burrito. Do you I feel think it's gonna be like tacos. Oh yeah, a burrito and tacos. Burrito and tacos, let me see. I feel the burrito definitely. Taco, I don't know. All I know is that it's not too heavy. Yeah, yeah, of course. Okay, ready? One, I'm gonna take a bun. Thank you. Thank you. What was your name? Hi, nice to meet you, bro. Okay. Yeah, yeah, thank you. All right, let's see guys. So, oh look. Nor. Oh, yes. We were right about the burrito. They even cut it in half for Yum. us. Oh my god. Oh wait, I'm so dumb. I'm like, they cut it in half for us, but probably the person in front of me <laughs> just ordered it cut in half. I was like, wow, they're so considerate. How'd they know we wanted it cut in half? So we know it's a burrito. We don't know what kind it is yet, but look, Nor, you were right. Look what else <gasps> is in here. A taco. Look at this. Oh my god. Oh yum. Dude, I freaking love Mexican food. Look, I could give you guys the rating before I even eat it. 10 out of 10. Wait, I we forgot something. What? Sauce. Uh, sauce. Do you like orange or green? The green one. The orange is too hot. No, I love the orange. Bro, it's Mexican food. It's okay <laughs> if it's a little spicy. Come on. All right. Okay, let's see what kind of burrito kind of this burrito. is. Okay, wait, wait, Nora, before you open it, I'm gonna let you guess. Do you think it's a California burrito, carne asada burrito, or surf and turf? What do you think? I think it's a breakfast burrito, bro. What time is it? That is true. It is pretty I early. Okay, Nora's going breakfast burrito. I'm going Cali, because we are in California. So California burrito, it only makes sense. Oh. Yum, wait, what is this? Look at this, guys. This is definitely Dude. carne asada burrito. You could tell. It's not a Cali, because a California burrito has fries. It's also not a breakfast because there's no eggs. This is definitely a carne asada burrito. Mmm. Mm. 10 out of 10. We were so hungry. <laughs> we both took a bite and forgot to put hot sauce. But anyways, guys, if you take a look inside the burrito, yep. it has carne asada, pico de gallo, and guacamole. Does it have cheese? No cheese. Carne asada, pico de gallo, guacamole. Plain, simple, but so delicious. It's a 10. 10 out of 10 for the burrito. Let's try the taco. This taco is huge, bro. There's a fat taco. Yum, the crunch. Mmm, this is bomb. This is so good. Mmm. This whole entire meal, 10 out of 10. Okay, Nora, so we got coffee in the morning. We had our first meal of the day. What do you think follows up some good food? I say some dessert. Some good? Specifically, 
ice cream. Look, I don't know about you guys, but I have a sweet tooth. I can't eat real food. I can't eat a meal and not follow up with dessert, candy, ice cream, something sugary, something sweet. I have a really big sweet tooth. So Nora, if you want ice cream, I'm down. Say less. Ice cream, oh wait, before we go grab dessert, here's a word from today's sponsor. Inflation has us all thinking of ways to save money. Whether that's dining out less or driving less to save gas, we can all agree on one thing. It's not fun being on a budget. Well, now thanks to Upside, you don't have to cut back because you can now get cash back on the money that you spend. All right, guys, let me show you what I'm talking about. So you open the Upside app, and usually I like to use Upside to save money on pumping gas. But today, I'm not gonna lie, I'm pretty hungry, so we're gonna click on the restaurant section, and we're gonna see how much cash back we could get from different restaurants. So right here, the first restaurant you see, Senor Burro, 15% cash back. That's a good deal, but let me keep going. Let me see, oh, a good steak, Outback Steakhouse. Uh, that's 6% cash back, so you don't get as much money back. Keep going down, you got smoke. Smoking Jay's Barbecue, 6% cash back. Don't get me wrong, 6% is a nice deal, but yo, nothing looks better than that 15% cash back, Senor Burro. So, it looks like I know what we're having for dinner. And look how easy this is. All you have to do is hit one button. Look at this, you click claim, boom. Just like that, I am locked in on getting 15% cash back on whatever I order for dinner tonight. Yes, that's right. I just made money by eating food. How lit is that? So the number one question I get asked, Brandon, you save so much money when you use Upside, you get so much cash back. What do you use that cash on? Well, I'm big on basketball shoes. You see, I got a pair of Kobe Grinches. Well, guess what? I'm ready to get myself a new pair of basketball shoes, something different. So all the cash back that I get from using Upside, yeah, it's definitely going towards a new pair of basketball shoes. To get started, click the link in my description, download the free Upside app in the App Store or Google Play, use my promo code BROWADIS, and get $5 or more cash back on your first purchase of at least 10 bucks. What are you guys waiting for? Go download the app. All right, guys, we finally pulled up for some dessert, and I'm ready for some ice cream, so I can't wait. Nora, you ready? Let's go in and get some ice cream. Okay, guys, so there's more than a few people in here. Look over my shoulder. So I wonder what they're gonna order. Letting the person in front of you decide what ice cream you're gonna get, it's neat because there's so many different ice cream flavors. Look at this, look. Look how many different ice cream flavors there are, bro. You just don't know what you're gonna get. So, Nora, I hope you're open-minded because we might get something crazy that somebody orders from here. Dude, I just like chocolate ice cream. Can we order whatever order was the last one? The same exact order as what they just had? Hey, stop recording. It's supposed to be a surprise. We're not supposed to know what they ordered till we get it. Look at what I got. Cotton candy. I love this flavor and I can't wait to try it. Nora, what about you? That's not cotton candy. What is this? This ain't rainbow sherbet, I'll tell you that much. No, it's the wild and reckless sherbet. Okay guys, so to get an exact description on what type of ice cream I have, it's actually right here in the back and it's called wild and reckless sherbet. It's literally sorbet. What is it called? Sorbet. It's sherbet. It's green apple, blue raspberry, and fruit punch. What is it called? Sherbert. Where's the R from the T? Is it not Sorbet? Hey, chat. Oh, wait, not chat. I'm not on Twitch. Okay, Nora's team Sorbet. I'm team Sherbert. I think this is called Sherbert. Sorbet, but. And I got what I wanted chocolate. Nora, this ice cream matches your personality. Plain and boring. That's perfect for you. Chocolate, you mean rich. Ready? Go. Oh, mine is sweet. Oh my god, it's so good. It's like literally like a chocolate bar melting in my mouth. If you guys know me, then you know I prefer sugary sweet desserts over like chocolate, peanut butter, caramel desserts. So this is fire to me. I'm like a little kid. I'm team Reese's. Anything chocolatey, peanut buttery. You like chocolate? Wait, but I do want to try this. Shout out to those kids who ordered this. It's sweet and sour, right? so sour, you're literally five. This is literally a kid's Dude, ice Dennis, cream. Dennis, try it. Hey, actually, Dennis got his Dennis, own ice cream for this one. Stuff. Even Dennis is eating good today. Hey, Dennis, try mine. It's so sweet. You might not like it. You're not a little kid like me. Google Gaga. Try it, try it. Dude, it's so good. It's good, right? It's so good. It's so sour. You're a hater, bro. Just because you're not four years old like us and you don't like sugary okay. sour. You know what, Dennis? You helped me film this whole video. This is all yours, bro. Oh my God, take your spoon. Look at this big bite. Mm. Okay, final rating for my ice cream. Very, very sweet. Just how I like it. 10 out of 10. I'm gonna give that one a four. Nobody asked you to rate if my I ice cream. Like, anyways, I rate mine a 10 out of 10. 
It's the perfect level of richness. It melts in your mouth. Yeah, please, I don't want to... Hey, what did you rate this, Noor? This is a 10. <laughs> hey, tell me I don't sound like Noor. <clears throat> hey, Brandon, what are we filming today? Okay, guys, look, I'm not gonna lie. After the coffee, the burrito, and the rainbow sherbet ice cream. Sorbet. Okay, you know what, guys? It's literally sorbet, bro. No, it's sherbet. It? Ow! <laughs> Honestly, I don't know about you, Nor, but I'm pretty full after all that food we just had. I know we still have one more meal for this video, oh, no. which is dinner. But can you eat right now? No. I cannot eat right now, so how about we wait a couple of hours till we get hungry again, and then we'll go have some dinner. Alright guys, so we just pulled up to BJ's and it's time to find out what we're eating for dinner. Let's go guys. How ironic is it that we're about to go to a food place and it's called BJ's? Like, I know what you're having for dinner. Cut the camera, please. Oh, man. Yo, guys, so I just looked at the BJ's menu. Look at this. There's so many options on this menu. There's literally hundreds of options. Like, there's so much variety. I have no idea what to expect. Like, what the last person at this restaurant ordered. Are you excited you took North spot in this video? Yeah, dude. The whole time I was drooling me on the camera. It was so bad you guys realized and had to feed me the ice cream part. <laughs> Wait, so the puddle that I stepped in outside of my car was your drool? Yes. Oh, I was gonna say it hasn't rained in San Diego in like a month. Okay, so this may seem odd, but can I just order whatever the last table you served ordered? Are you sure? Oh, hey, yo, she's actually- She's making me rethink my decision, but it's for the video, so we have to do it. Is it that bad? You'll see. Oh my <laughs> God. Hey, bro, I'm not gonna lie. The waitress, like, she scared me. Hey, I won't say nothing about extra food. <laughs> it won't be extra after I eat it. All right, guys, so now we're just, we're sitting here waiting for the food, and we have absolutely no idea what plates are about to come our way. <laughs> but hey, let's wait and see. Oh, my God. Bro, why please, are you acting? please. But the thing is, you're acting brand new for the camera because you be doing that shit off camera. When have I not, when have I done it on, off camera? You want me to show them the picture? Of you forcingly sitting on me? Of you forcingly sitting on me? Bro, the food finally came. All right, guys. So it actually does look like the people before us ordered a lot of food. And I'm not complaining. <laughs> it actually looks so good. Look, over here, you got boneless wings. Over here, it looks like you got turkey, avocado, bacon sandwich with some fries. Nice little pizza. This looks like deep dish. An extra side of fries. And then we got some veggies. We got Brussels sprouts and celery. Bro, what the f do I look like eating veggies? <laughs> Everything looked fine until I seen those two. All right, guys, it's only right we start with the appetizer, boneless wings. I'm not gonna lie, I'm excited to try it because it smells good, but I'm more of a bone-in type of guy, not, not boneless. These are more like chicken nuggets. If I'm eating chicken, I'm eating it bone-in, bro. That's just me, though. Oh, that's a nice one right here. You know, guys, I feel like Dennis murdered Nora and hit her body just so he could be in the end of this video. We'll so talk about that after. All right, get some ranch. Go ahead, Dennis, and let's try it. It's so bomb. Mmm. Wait, that's really good. Hey, I think we should do a part two to this tomorrow. <laughs> Every time we film a food video, you want to do a part two. People love them, and I love them. Oh, should we go in for the sandwich? I'm down for the sandwich. Okay. It looks like a turkey bacon avocado sandwich. Some fries on the side. And they cut the sandwich in half. I wasn't doing that, but okay. Mm. I have an idea. Let's get the smallest fry we could find, and then we, like, eat it. Hmm. What was that? We're gonna open it up. Avocado. And then on this side. Oh, that's chicken. That's not turkey. Some bacon. Some cheese. It looks bomb. Cheers, Dennis. Cheers. Cheers. We bite this one. This is good. That's really good. That's fire. I'm giving this a 10 of 10. And hold on. Let me one up that. I think this is my new go to when I come here. I'm gonna start ordering this as a meal, bro. This is fire. Really? You didn't like it? I think it's fire, but I'll give it like an eight. Okay, next up, guys, we got a pizza. I honestly wouldn't be able to tell you what flavor it is, but we're about to find out. It 
This is so good, dude. This is amazing. It's so fluffy, like it's so thick. Usually pizza over here in California is like, it's like a thinner crust. This is like a Chicago style pizza, right? Like a deep dish. Yo, whoever the people before us were, dude, I want to marry them. Literally everything we ate was good. Until they got to the Brussels, whatever that thing is Brussels called. Brussels sprouts. This is so good. Serious question. Huh? Do I got to try that? <laughs> Bro, you act like this is... We're asking you to eat like poison or snake venom. It's veggies. It's food. I'm good. I'm I'm good off the veggies. Come on, Dennis. Let's just try it. Nope, bro. Come on, Dennis. Let's try. It. All right, guys. So Chanel willingly volunteered to be the special guest to try the veggies. I love Brussels sprouts, by the way. Definitely not forced. She wasn't put in a chokehold by Dennis or anything like that. And strangled and forced to be sitting here eating the veggies. But anyways, let's try it. Hey, they don't look bad. I'm not gonna lie. Ready? They smell good. Cheers. Cheers. Wow, I can tell Chanel really liked these. Look, she's it's going in so for second. Good. But it wasn't bad. It actually tasted pretty good. I give it a 7 out of 10. 10 out of 10 for me. 10? Dennis. I thought they were good. Chanel rated it a 10 of 10. Just try it here. No. Dennis, look. Dennis, Keep the veggies away from me. A bite. <laughs> okay, okay. Bro, and don't even think about the celery. Put the celery down. Put the celery. At least that had some like seasonings and stuff. Put the celery away. What's wrong with celery? <laughs> it's too healthy. Oh. Before we close out this video, let me know in the comment section down below if you want Dennis to face his biggest fear and try veggies for 24 hours for the next video. Please. That's a good idea, right? That's a great idea. <laughs>